Dimensional analysis is a problem-solving method that uses the fact that any number or expression can be multiplied by one without changing its value. To begin, measurement is the comparison of size and objects. Some examples are length, area, volume, weight, and time. In this example, two pounds equals one pound plus one pound. And in this example, three centimeters equals one centimeter plus one centimeter plus one centimeter. And these equal signs just mean that this is equivalent to this. In the comparison with a fixed reference amount of quantity, a reference amount is a unit. Some examples of units are length, mass, and time. For example, the time it takes to go around an entire circle, or the length between A and B or the mass of an object and how heavy it is if it fell on someone's head. An example of dimensional analysis would be how many minutes are in 73 hours. The conversion factor we would use for this would be one hour equals 60 minutes. To start off, we put the 73 hours. Make sure to put your unit, this is your unit, over one minute, and notice that we put the units here too. Multiply that by 60 minutes over one hour, so you're going to take your hours and they're going to cancel out when you multiply. This is why we put hours on top and hours on the bottom. And then you're going to multiply 73 by 60, and that will give you your answer of 4,380 minutes in 73 hours. Sometimes multiple conversions are necessary. For this question, how many miles are in 126,720 inches? So we're converting from miles to inches. The two conversion factors you need for this is 12 inches equals one foot and 5,280 feet equals one mile. So we start off with what we know, which is 126,720 inches. And we multiply that by one foot over 12 inches. We do, we put the inches on the bottom so that we can cancel these two out. We then multiply one mile over 5,280 feet. Again, we do this so we can cancel the feet out. So when we start canceling out, we can cancel our inches and we can also cancel our feet which gives us miles, which is what we're looking for in the problem. So once you multiply 12 times 5,280, you divide it by 126,720 inches. That answer gives you two miles and 126,720 inches. Now we're going to talk about scaling. For scaling factor for the perimeter, we're going from A to B. So since A has 2 and B is 4, then if you're going from A to B, your scaling factor will be times 2. If you're going from B to A, then it's 1 half because 2 is 1 half of 4. When you're doing an area scaling factor, you have to find the area for block A and the area for block B. So the area for block A is two times two, which is four, and the area for block B is four times four, which is 16. So your area scaling factor will be times four because four times four is 16. So if you had a problem like this and you needed to find the dimensions of block B, you'd multiply three times two, which equals six, and then to check that, you find the area scaling factor, which will have to be times 4. So the area of A and B is 9 and 36. Then you divide 36 divided by 9, which equals 4.